Hi, I'm Miss Deb, and I'm a teaching artist for the Van Wazel. And welcome to the Think Like a Dancer series. Today, we are going to explore the dance element, energy. Energy is the how of the movement. How did the dancer move? Was it strong or was it weak? Was it tight or was it loose or sharp or smooth? So what we're going to do today is we are going to learn the energy dance. We are going to start out by holding a heavy box over our heads. And I mean heavy, and you should feel it in your whole body. And we're just going to step touch while we're holding this heavy box. And then we're going to set the box down. So it's one, two, three, four, five. Let me see it in your face, in your arms, in your back. Seven, eight. Now the opposite of strong is weak. So we're just going to think there's very little energy that it takes for us to do this movement. Think of like a bubble and we're going to go bubble, bubble, then pop, 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 bubble, bubble, pop, 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 pop. Now we have tight. You want to think that everything is pulled inside really tight. And we're going to pretend that we're a boxer and we have up, up, down, down, up, up, down, down, up, up, down, down. The opposite of tight is loose. So you're going to just let your body be loose like a rag doll or think of that blow up guy at the gas station. Everything is loose. So we have strong, weak, tight, loose, and we have sharp. So we're going to start out with our arms strong and we're going to clap under our leg. Sharp, two, sharp, three, sharp, sharp. The opposite of sharp is smooth. And you want to think that you're just gliding. It's like one long musical nose very sustained. So keep it very, very smooth and even flowing. All right, we're ready to put all this together in the energy dance. Thank you for joining us and please come back for another episode of Think Like a Dancer.